When company arrives unexpectedly, the last thing you need is a complicated recipe. So chef and TV host Lynn Crawford is in the AM kitchen this morning with quick and easy dinner ideas using staples you've probably already got in your cupboards. And it's that last minute thing that can drive us nuts. And that's it, you know, Bev. I mean, it, we're coming upon the holiday season and, and, and I'm all about getting ready for yeah. those unexpected, wonderful guests that are going to be coming to your home and making sure that your pantry is just filled with wonderful ingredients that you can, you know, it's it's the go-tos, right? And so, I want to be that that person when yeah. someone drops and we, just, we were talking about something lovely we were talking about that earlier but in the pantry you know I love a good range of great olive oils and vinegars okay. uh, great mayonnaise is an also another a great one that I always have on hand some hot sauces and some specialty flavors and you know ingredients like I love shrimp yes and me too. A, a, you know a little um, spicy Thai shrimp cake with this wonderful sesame mayonnaise dipping sauce to go with it is so quick and easy. All of those things you've mentioned in terms of staples in a pantry and then with the shrimp you could have on hand for either appetizer or meal. That's right, exactly. And you know, making it a little bit more fun with great flavors and good quality mm. ingredients. I mean, Let's do you want to try. Let's I make do. this okay. because I, I, it's so how. simple. <laughs> no, it's really a, a wonderful, simple recipe. It's shrimp that okay. we've diced up, some panko breadcrumbs, and to um to that 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 mixture. We're almost going to make these little patties here. I'm going to add some scallions, some jalapenos, and some garlic. Lots of fresh cilantro, oh, yeah. which is just fresh and yummy. I'm a huge cilantro fan. Now the egg white just gives it a little bit of binding, and you know we're going to put in some mayonnaise here. Which adds that lovely creaminess to the to the shrimp cake. So you like maybe three tablespoons. -ish. Yeah, and I'm going to make sure that this recipe is on your website. Okay, so, okay, you can have that later for everybody to okay. to try that. So you basically just pulse that all together so that you get this wonderful, wonderful consistency. Oh, I love that. So these cakes we've already made, and we're onto a, a little warm frying pan here. Okay. Maybe you want to put those in, Beth. Okay. We're going to put these little shrimp cakes right into the 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 olive oil and they sizzle away and you know I this makes me very happy just as you said for an appetizer yeah. but also for like a little main course these now it looks so great easy fast dipping sauces with yeah. lots of punch and lots of great flavor and texture we have mayonnaise and I put in a little bit of yogurt to that so oh, good this chili garlic garlic chili paste I love so much Is it hot? It's hot. Look, I made it really <laughs> hot. <laughs> we have some rice wine vinegar mm -hmm. for a little bit of wonderful tart the and acidity. Kind of, yep. And this wonderful okay. nutty mm, yes. sesame oil, toasted sesame oil, just a little drizzle of that. And this makes the fastest the most delicious dipping sauce. I love that because these things you can keep for a while in your pantry. You don't have to worry because they're it. jarred or and that's it. And you know, we're like we said, you know, you're you're going to into the holiday seasons and you want it to be, you know, easy things. Don't stress out. Well, that's so easy. I love it. The, How looks, long do you keep these guys in there? They're gonna flip, look, nice golden okay. brown. And you know, about two to three minutes per side. And then we have the final. Let me just dip one. Are you in? Sure. As long as it's not too oh. hot, I'm gonna. <laughs> no, it's, it's really like. Mmm. Great flavor. Mm. You know the lemon. Oh, that's fantastic. Sorry, the lime in the in the mixture with the spice. Delicious. And again, pantry items that readily available. Perfect. And, and I you use, could serve this for a meal for sure, like part of a meal, right? Like I, I love it I, as an appetizer. I, this, this with a nice side salad would be perfect. But as a little cocktail reception, mm -hmm. you know, when your guests arrive, these little um, these little shrimp cakes are delicious. But oh, wait, I, we're almost running out of time. I've got to mention. Yes. This big event coming up on the weekend that oh you're taking part in, Cook for yes, the Cure. and so are you. <laughs> I get the, the light lifting, though. I get to try what you You make. are going to be one of the esteemed judges. And, yes, the culinaryshowdown.ca is where you can go check that out. And we're going to be... Uh, Raising money yeah. for the Canadian Breast Cancer um, Foundation, and I'm excited. I'm one of five chefs competing this year, as you know. So it's such a great event, and the it, money's raised, and you've taken part in it every year. And you know, 
uh, with, the, with the kind of teams that you get and the money that is raised, it's really awesome. Yeah, it really is a fun, fun event. I encourage everybody to go online and, and uh, you know, donate and, and, and uh, cheer on the chefs, and Perfect. it's really we'll for do. a great cause. So look forward to seeing you on see Saturday. You Saturday. Thanks for coming in this morning and making these. These are fantastic. Listen, maybe, uh, maybe I could make these on you Saturday could. night, right? You could, because <laughs> I've already passed judgment. They're fantastic. <laughs> yes. <Okay. laughs> You'll find a link to um, the Culinary Showdown and Lynn's recipes on our website, kevinam.cdbnews.ca.